my whole life, I was taught to look to the priest to lead me. Advice Father Beth G has used to model his priesthood in his assignment of Incarnation Church in Queens Village. Born in Glendale, Queens, some of Father Chris's biggest heroes are his parish priests, who helped him cope with his parents' divorce at the age of eight. In that experience, it was really the priests at my parish who kind of stepped in to be those father figures for me giving him his first thoughts about the priesthood. As he continued on to Cathedral Prep High School and the College Seminary, priests again deepened his vocation. All the priests that I met really instilled in me what it meant to be a priest, how to love God's people as a priest, and how to love the priesthood. A love that would travel with Father Chris to Costa Rica, where he was sent while still in the seminary for Spanish language training. It was the first time I'd ever been on a plane. It was the first time I'd ever traveled a bit away for six weeks. So the experience was a bit overwhelming for me. But just like his home parish, the congregation in Costa Rica became family and prepared him for his new role. Father, Son, Father Chris says the moment that stood out to him on ordination day was the look on his family's face as he walked down the aisle. Just the joy that I saw with them. That's what something I'll always keep with me from that day. Now at his first parish, Incarnation, Father Chris hopes to be the same sort of model parish priests were for him. Incarnation is emblematic of the diocese, multi-ethnic, consisting of Spanish, Filipino, and Haitian parishioners. Father Chris says a challenge for him is that even with his language training, he still struggles to express himself. But I don't feel that I'm at the point yet where I can offer them the same I offer the English speakers because my Spanish just isn't that sufficient as of yet. But Father Chris strives to learn a little more every day because he knows what's at stake. People come to the priest not to meet the priest, but to meet God. And he hopes to bring God to his people, just like God came to him. Reporting for Currents, I'm Katie Angusser.